Portacaths, or ports, are vascular access devices used for the treatment of chemotherapy that is given intravenously. Portacaths sit underneath the skin and a catheter goes into a large vein. This helps in the chemotherapy administration and can also be used to draw blood for blood counts and blood tests. This is also a safe way to give chemotherapy with less chance of the chemotherapy leaking out of the vein and causing any damage to skin or other tissues. The portacath, shown here, is accessed with a needle that goes through the skin and into the portacath chamber. So blood fills the chamber and can be withdrawn through the needle to have blood tests done before chemotherapy. And then at the time of chemotherapy treatment, the chemotherapy drug is given through the needle into the chamber and then into the vein through the catheter. At the completion of your chemotherapy treatment, the needle will be removed from the port and from the skin so that when you go home, there isn't any needle or any catheters or anything that require care. Simply keep the skin clean and dry. Once a patient's cancer treatment is completed and they no longer require chemotherapy, the portacath can be removed as a simple outpatient procedure. Sometimes your doctor may ask you to keep the portacath in for a little bit longer in case of additional blood draws or possible additional treatments. If a portacath is going to be maintained after the completion of cancer treatment, it needs to be flushed once a month to prevent blood clots from forming in the catheter.